This Never is fun. a 172, so uh, people have the option of training on these planes or a smaller plane over there, which is a 152. Emily Reed grew up around planes. Her dad is a pilot, and she's known she's wanted to do the same since she was a little girl. So whenever my dad had the chance, he would take me to the, to the airport. Um, so that's what kind of got me into flying and being around planes. Reed wants to be a commercial airline pilot. The first step is getting her private flying license. Okay, you ready? To do that, she has to earn flying hours. So today she's flying alongside her instructor, Sandra Pru at Harv's Air. See, if the other person's excited, I get excited too, because I'm like, yeah, you're gonna go learn how to fly, and I get to share that. Both women say they love the exhilarating freedom of flying and know it's the perfect career fit for them. But according to Service Canada statistics, only 6.5% of pilots, flight engineers, and flying instructors are female. That statistic never stopped Reed. I think the people around me always encouraged me, and it was nothing about being a female or a male. And I think uh, I think we're treated equally at this point, in, especially at Harv's Air. Yeah. There's nothing different between me and a male student pilot. Reed Pru and the International Organization of Women Pilots want to introduce more females to aviation with an event called Women Fly. First time, female flyers will get free flights and introductory ground school courses. The goal is to let more women and girls know a career in aviation is a possibility and an exciting one at that. I think it's exhilarating. Occasionally I, I'll be flying with a student and I'll feel like, hey, I'm flying an airplane. <laughs> this is cool. So it's, it's different than anything else, but it's the excitement of being in the air and seeing a different perspective. Women Fly is on March 7th at St. Andrews Airport. For more information, you can visit womenofaviationweek.org. For Go Winnipeg, I'm Jessica Cable.